This is an x-ray of a 14 years old child in a PA view and it was diagnosed as tension pneumothorax. And this is the same view. Now we magnify the view. The first finding in this chest x-ray is shifting of the mediastinum to the right side. The second finding of the same chest x-ray is a collapse of the left lung. Third finding is the trachea deviation to the right side. These findings, you should know them by heart for surgery exam. It will come either in OSCE or MCQ or both of them. They may ask you, what are the findings of this x-ray? And the next question, what are the signs and symptoms in those with tension pneumothorax? Or what will they present? They come with the two T's tachypnea and tachycardia, elevated JVP, chest pain, and sometimes asymptomatic. In percussion, you will hear hyperresonance. The examiner might ask if all of the signs and symptoms are present, except in percussion, you hear dull sound. What is your diagnosis? The answer is, you suspect hemothorax. Now, we are going to show you the same patient but he developed another tension pneumothorax, but in the right side. And in this finding, you see the shift mediastinum to the left side and collapse of the right lung. The question is, why did he develop another tension pneumothorax in the right side? In CT scan, it was found he had multiple inflammatory bullae in both sides of the lung. In this chest x-ray, I have pointed at the infimatous bullae. We classify the causes of pneumothorax traumatic, iatrogenic, spontaneous. In traumatic, we further subclassify into penetrating and non penetrating. In iatrogenic, we further subclassify into thoracosynthesis and central venous catheter. And in spontaneous, we further subclassify into primary, which is not associated with lung disease, and secondary, which is associated with lung disease, such as pneumonia, abscess, lung cancer, and emphysema. And my reference is Toronto's Notes, 2014. And this is a summary of the case and thank you very much for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe. Mm -hmm.